ownership and the freedom of expression. Marty Schwimmer is a trademark and copyright attorney. He's looked at both sides of this uh, uh, argument, uh, represented both sides, I believe, uh, Marty. Joining us uh, out of New York tonight, firstly, is this legislation as we see it and hear it being discussed likely to get passed, do you think? I think that there's no possibility of the legislation being passed. Uh, over the weekend, the White House said that they are opposed to some of the most objectionable parts of uh, the legislation. So the answer to that is no. Draconian legislation um, is uh, destructive le legislation is what uh, certainly Jimmy Wales, the CEO of the website uh, Wikipedia, um, is suggesting. Uh, an, an infringement on uh, on the sort of the very nature of the web which of course is open that's his side of the argument those who are looking to make money out of the web and the movie and media companies say listen we need this sort of legislation who's right um all of my clients are right um <laughs> No, I, I don't understand why it has to be a choice. I mean, it is presented to us as that it's either censorship or piracy. I don't understand why we can't have trusted e-commerce where you know what you're buying, and at the same time we have freedom of exp expression. Um, so I think both sides are being a little bit, um, they're exaggerating for now. Jimmy Wells' is, uh, blackout is for 24 hours. Do you see it having much impact certainly to the 25 million users who use Wikipedia on a daily basis, they're, they're going to suffer. But is, is this sort of protest uh, going to make much of an impact, do you think, to those making the decisions about legislation going forward? You know, one of my son's 15-year-old friends was over, over the house and said, um, what's your position on SOPA? And this is the first time that he's ever asked me my view on intellectual property uh, pending legislation. So, so yes, this sort of blackout is going to focus a lot of attention. It's going to shine a spotlight on something that candidly would have been rammed through otherwise. So the answer is yes, the blackout is going to focus attention and, you know, sunlight is a disinfectant. What sort of damage does it do to President Obama when he is accused of getting into bed with Silicon Valley to the detriment of the big commercial media and, mogul, uh, media and movie companies? Well, I mean, he did come out this weekend against the most egregious aspects of the legislation, although I have seen the reaction to that is that they don't believe him in view of other politics, and I'm not qualified to talk about that. But I think that there's an opportunity for him to come up with a good and needed compromise, which he calls for. Marty, you're an expert on the subject. We thank you very much indeed for coming on and sorting it out for us this evening.